We're good. Here we go. We're gonna tear this place up. Yes. Hi friends and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm in Cal- no, I'm not in California. I'm in Colorado at the ARC thrift store. We're with Michael and David and Susie and Amy and Sarah and Mark and Bob and Bree and Barry and we're all filming. Let's go see. Let's go see what we can find at the ARC. Michael's getting his filming ready. David. We're good. Here we go. We're gonna tear this place up. That's interesting. That's interesting. It's kind of neat though. It has a really nice sound to it. It's very ring a ding clean. Why do I like this? <laughs> I don't, because it's upcycled vintage and it's got fun beads on it. I think I'm gonna get that. It's $4.99, but I think that it's cool and it makes a really nice sound. And I can easily get that. I can easily get that in. Oh look, here's a thing, a sheath, so you can carry your is your knife. Oh. It's for your wieners. This is Sarah of Traveling Button, by the way. Oh, hello. <laughs> this you, is a sheath for your wieners. You, you could put probably three corn dogs in that. Yeah, I bet we could cram probably to go. Look, if we did like this, you could. I mean, and you you have a little handle yeah. on it. I found a new spot Aww. to put. Uh, it's B. It's BK's little. Oh my gosh, that's we'll perfect. put him in the hole when he's bad. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. That's his timeout. That's his timeout time stump. Yeah. They're dancing hamsters. This is Captain Carl. Captain and that's Carl? Sergeant Scruffy. Captain Carl and Sergeant Scruffy. So I brought out a new cart. I'm just going to take a sneaky peeky peek. I'm not seeing anything in that cart. Let's look at this cart. Not a whole lot yet. Pillowcases. Oh. Pillowcases. That's the. Oh, look at this. Yeah, that's for a lamp or something. Yeah. Susie, where do we look at this? Well. Shark bite. I do. There's some warped candles. Sarah said that she found some There's Danish some modern. Scented twisties. Some Danish modern candlestick holders at this particular arc before, so taking a little bit closer look. <laughs> Glossy baby. Oh, yes. No, Mikasa. I swear to God, Mikasa candlesticks, they look so much like Glassy Baby. And they honestly, they feel a lot like Glassy Baby too. I love looking at the mugs. Dieting is wishful shrinking. How much are their mugs? Their mugs are 99 cents here. This is a Padilla set here. So that's, I'm not gonna get this because I don't wanna take it back with me on the plane, but this is a nice set for $3.99. It's Padilla, it's missing two of the mugs, but a great pottery, great for resale, pottery coffee mugs there. Here is a cut to clear big base. I've sold a small one like this. This is beautiful. I'm not gonna get that, but it's a beauty. This is really kinda neat too. I think it's a studio piece. I think maybe not. Made in Peru. That's pretty. Oh, there's more. That's pretty cool. Let's see. Oh, Michael was looking for a travel mug. I'll have to see if he's looked at any of these. Just to use while we're here, he forgot his. It's a nice little Lazy Susan down there. Oh, I wonder if David has seen this. Which is to David. No. Oh, I love these. This is a vintage dish strainer. That green color. I like these. They're nice though too to for storage. Um, for your your reselling plates and stuff. I like this bar on this cart is wigging me out. I keep thinking like it's someone standing there. Someone standing there. It's here. Not that not are you sure? I don't know. Feel it. It's damn heavy. I think that's Blanco. But I don't think they did an ombre. You have to put they that do. in your cart and research that, this buddy. This isn't Blanco, is it? Mister Sun. Sun. This is a nice. This looks like something David would like too. Oh, it's got a boober there. Cheeses. Look at all the cheeses. Oh, I guess it's pasta too. Yeah, I'm good. Cheese and pasta. 
on that. I know. I don't think so, but I didn't think so because the Let's see. Well, this is kind of pretty. That's hand painted. Definitely. I think that's pretty. <laughs> oh my gosh, I think we had this. Oh my gosh, that son has seen some things. There's a little pig napkin holder, a little wooden pig napkin holder. Mm, oh my gosh, look, you could hang your coasters right there. That's nice. These are kind of nice too, the cutting boards. They're $2.99 each. Look at the Rolodex. These are OMC. Those are bookends. Are there's only one? No, there are two. Oh, they're I'll two get together. Where'd you see the the OMCs right? Oh here. yeah, the oh, Otagiri. Really, yeah, yeah, really. Oh, good. I'll get those. Yeah. Thanks, Sarah. Yeah, of course. Those will be easy to take on the plane. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Yay! Else wants oh my gosh, there's a scary man right there. Scary man. Oh my god. <laughs> You know, you just, why why hold your phone when you could put it around your neck? Look at this Rolodex. That is a t oh time my God, gone that's by. Oh school Rolo. That's fun. I like looking through all this like office type too. stuff. This Here's is some um, creative memories. Yes. These used to be so. Expensive. Yeah, they did. My mom used to do that. I I always I attempted to do that. Never, just never did. Just never did. I just sold that. And it had the little cheese spreader. Okay, yeah. Cheese. It, it's like fate. Hey, you got any of that garlic cheese. spread, Sarah? Uh, <laughs> garlic spread. At the house? <laughs> okay, I'm going to get yeah. some later. Missy came in this morning talking about, <laughs> where's that garlic dip, Sarah? It's, so good. it's so Trader we're Joe's. We're going to Trader Joe's and get some more garlic dip. Oh, so good. So this, I believe, is a wine, a wine bottle holder? Yeah, I think. I don't know. I think that's a wine bottle holder. What is this? Oh my word, that's a hippo with teeth. Wow, that's kind of cool though. I wonder if, I think we need to show this. Oh wait, okay, let me put you here. Here's a little brass owl trivet for, it's got all four of the little stoppers on it and it is $2.99. I don't know. I'm going to put both of these in a cart to at least think about. But I also saw this. And I just watched Michael's video, The Cult of Vintage. And he had found this. And his mom had it. But this one's in much worse shape. But and that's funny that that's there. It was just in his video. This is a, um, this is vintage. Yeah, this is with the Oneida, and they have this like kind of enamel finish. I've seen the, I've sold the bowls um, like this before that had the blue on the outside and the silver on the inside. What else is up here? Is this another one? Oh, I don't know that that one's in Oneida though. Mm, little metal decor. Oh my gosh, that's adorable with the. Um, with the, I wonder if it works. Let me see if it works. Fortunately, unfortunately, it doesn't work. I, if it did, I probably would have bought it. But I don't know. David maybe can tinker around with that. Maybe he can get that to work. But let's see. What are we missing? Anything down here at the bottom? That's a lot of just like a lot of fun things to see. Okay. Okay. I think. We, what's this? Oh, these are um, a 50th anniversary. Are they all? I don't know if Michael had seen these. These crucifixes with Jesus. Maybe he has, but I'll make sure he knows about them. The linens. This is like a nice patio something, I think. Let's see little red gingham there little homey oh look at the little crazy cats on it somebody made, has made those trucks my gosh we're gonna run into each other oh with these God. big our, our, we, poles, our poles our poles our poles are gonna touch <laughs> we're gonna get hit by lightning <laughs> oh gosh all right let's see I'm not used to having poles in my carts. If you are, if you have poles on your carts, you let me know in the comments. 
I'm curious. This is cute, this little piece of cruel here. That's adorable. Someone's made that. I could put that in a frame. Oh, that's sweet. That's cute. Yeah, that's a little, with a little owl up in the tree. So look at that, that'll be, there's another little piece of tribal. Cruel Southwestern, 19. 87, the creative circle. That'd be pretty in a frame, too. Yes, it would. It just needs to be stretched. Yeah, and ironed. And then this. What is this? That's like a... Needle. Oh, yeah. It's like a new needle point, too. All right. Well, well, did you I see mean... This one? I did for the deer. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of... It needs, it needs some help. Meow. 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 So I'm going to get oh, this. You can... Um, so all i got to do is stuff these. The two ninety nine. I'm gonna get them. There's like a little baby cat and their mamas, so that's fun. Well, you know, I'm gonna look at the toys and the plush. Just gonna take a quick look. There's a big pig with a bow tie right there, and we got babies hanging up. We got a, a little camel. Another little camel. Always look for the vintage, the vintage plush. Oh, here's a little raggedy Andy. He doesn't have a shoe. He's missing his shoe. What are you? A little cup of coffee? Well, there's Snoopy. Sometimes these bags, like look, here's Power Rangers in here. And some of these older Power Rangers can do pretty well. Um, especially the Sabian. You can, usually there's a date back there, but let's see if there's any more. Yeah, there's a green one right there. Especially if you lot them together. I just don't know how much are their grab bags. $4.99. I just don't know if I'm going to spend $4.99 on those two Power Rangers. But, you know, it's fun to look at these little these little guys here. Because sometimes, like, there's Care Bears. That's not a vintage Care Bear. But, um, I just like these little, these little, these little plastic toy guys. So, I do like to look through them. Cooties. There's some cars. I'm sure Mark has already looked through them. It's like one of the first things that he comes and looks at. Oh, there's a little rocket ship. I wonder. That would be cute to do a little, a little display with. I might have to get that. I want to do a little display with it. It might be cute at Christmas. Oh, also, Mark found this shirt. Now, we don't do a lot of clothing. But this is a bib, like from a race, like a, a cycling race. It's $6.99, but it sell it sold for like $200 or something. I'll I'll put the comp up. So I don't know. I mean, we're gonna we might try that. Oh no, a Jack in the Box <gasps> nightmare. Oh, what's this? It's a bubble wand. Oh wait, what's this hat? Colorado life. I kind of like that. It's a new hat. Be a good little souvenir. I always look for souvenirs at the thrift stores when I'm, whenever I go on vacation anywhere. Look, there's Hey Arnold. Right there. Oh, there's the... Oh, no, I thought you were the Kool-Aid man. He's not. But I love looking through all these bags and stuff. All right, let's keep looking down the way. Oh my gosh, look at the little underpants. Oh, this would be a cute little display to make a little vignette out of this little um, seafoam green colander. That would be a cute display. There's a little, some little tea sets in here. So, I mean, I guess my point is when you're at the thrift stores, look at the toys. Because you can find some fun, like this one put a vase here. So sometimes you can find things that people, little Kirby, that people have just left. Hello. Oh my gosh, you scared me. I'm sorry. Look, I'm so sorry. Look, it's what brand new. <gasps> yeah, David just got a hat here the other day that's brand yeah, new. Yeah, it's been to, it's something real estate, but I don't care. That's cool. Who cares? We gonna get it. Sarah was nice enough to find this for me. I'm gonna get it. It'd be nice to take home. It's a little Flavia. Um, 1969, but it's got this older couple on Look it. Look how sweet they're they traveling. are. Travel romance. romance. S maybe something sees. And, yeah. Oh, I just love it's their cute. little gray hair. It's cute. So we're yeah. going to get that. Sarah found this little, this is 1997, little NASA space, 
space thing, but that was just laying over here too. So let's look at the books real quick. We got Winnie the Pooh. No, I, I don't. I'm fine. No. Yeah. Celebration of the Silly Old Bear. Oh, really? I love. I could just sit and look through all of these books. Winnie the Pooh. I don't. Oh, look, here's Party Time. This is a Whitman book. Let's see. It's 99 cents. Um, it's only been car colored in just a little. So I don't know. I usually just try to buy them if they've not been colored in before. Where's Michael? Where's Michael? Where's Michael? Oh, I see him. He's way over there is Michael. This is like where you're looking for Michael Jackson. Not for the cult of vintage Michael. So we're not going to get that one. Oh, Michael found him an Afghan. Of course he did. He always finds the best Afghans. Oh, wow. I'm going to get this little Uncle Wiggly's in his friend book. It's a reprint from the 80s, but I love the Uncle Wiggly books. And so this has a bunch of them in there. So I'm going to get that as well. All right. Well, Amy handed me this little, and it's a jar. It's, it's $3.99. It has great colors on it. So I think I'm going to get that too. Yeah. Here's a little cups from Hawaii. Those are kind of cool. That one has a little chip in it. So I think we're getting ready to go over to another arc. So we'll see what we can find over there. All right. This is arc thrift store number two here in Colorado Springs. Let's go. So Cheyenne Mountain right there. and Pikes Peak. Peak. Is right there. And there's Bree. And Mark's already gone inside. Well, all right, Mark's in it. Here we go. The Ark Thrift Store. We're pull free on our carts. Yay, yay. So we're going to look through the baskets. Oh, these are so cute. I don't know, but they are. Right? I love those colors. It's because we like really these cute. colors. What's this? Oh, like fossils. Fossil, a fossil cup. It's professionally framed. That's kind of cool. $12.99 though. Eek. Eek. Oh, did you put that there? Oh my gosh. You did too, you kidder. Yes, I'm going to get this. It's $10.95, but that's a cool little piece of art glass. Little Noopy Vintage Noopy playing cards for $2.99. Those are cute. All right, what else is in here? I want to dig through all. Oh, look, we've got the barbecue man fork. I'll tell you when your food is done. That threshold is Target. Let's see. Got some cooking utensils. Some little wooden coasters. CIA? No. There you go. American Revolution Bicentennial, 200 years. Yeah, that'd be great with your garage. Yeah, heck yeah. Heck yeah. All right, so I guess I'm gonna go down here because everybody else went down the other aisle. So we're gonna check, we're gonna check here. Oh, Sarah found some stuff. Oh, some little egg cups. Oh, they got, that one has a boober on it though. But you could get two. Yeah, I could. Those are really, really cute. Yep, I'm gonna get those. I'm gonna leave that one because it's got a boober. But these are beautiful. Love those. That's a no. That is a no right there, that guy. Let's see. It's a little bunny. Boy, this is a lot of fun. You just don't have this kind of vintage in the thrift stores where I hail from. There's a little tile ceramic tile trivet there. Oh, this was a souvenir of Alan A. Camp. This is, I wonder if it has the the top of it somewhere. It's got a boober on it though, unfortunately. There's little bunnies in there. Oh, he's cute. He's got a little rubber ducky. He's a cute little guy. A little pottery. Um, napkin rings. Those are kind of cute. Looks like a Santa Claus beard. There. Santa Claus beard. Yeah. Santa Claus dreads. Dreadlocks. Spoon rest. Stamp out home cooking. Why? Why are we stamping it out? This 
little Mexican pottery bowls are pretty. It's got a boober on it though, rats. There's a little Mexican pottery cat and bird and plate. It's like you put the ashes of your dog in there maybe, I don't know. These are kind of cool, these little Copa, uh, Copa Keshi, Copa Kelly guys. Those are different. $12.99 each though. Glass of flower. Mm. Look at that little Angie Swan. Uh -uh. This is a really, it's a little home co bears that have been murdered. They've been completely annihilated. That's sad. What's this do? Oh, yeah, pop out of that. You pop something out of that. Metal roosters and a great collar, but $14.99 is a little much. A little much there. Let's see. This is a really cool lacquer box for $1.99. That's pretty. This is a vintage little lipstick holder. She has some issues, a little folk art piece. She can hang on the wall. I know she's got some issues, but these are really hard to find. So I am going to get her today. Keep off the grass. It's a little totem pole. There's just so many fun things to see. Oh, wow. Oh, this is cool. I had one like this that did not sell. So I'm not going to get that little Mexican pottery piece. It's $3.99, but just not going to get that. It's not going to work today. Look at, these, look at these babies in their little crocheted dresses. One and two. Little padres. Oh, here's a hamburger press. I see those a lot. A copy of Florence Ceramics. Little brass. Another little brass thing. Ooh, the Hummus Society. Oh, I'm not allowed to have these. Here's a little doggy. A little dog for little, your little air plants. He's a cute little fat. Oh, here's someone's kitty cat. A kitty. Here's a little piece of whole pottery. Unfortunately, it's got a big repair on it and a big boober out of it. All right, guys, that was the shopping trip from Two Arcs here in um, Colorado Springs. It was so much fun. Thank you to Sarah for showing us around and letting me you know, really some stuff. Time. We're going to go have some lunch, but I'm going to go ahead and end this video, but there's going to be so many more videos. I did it again. From this. Awkward wave. <laughs> there's going to be so many videos from this trip, so make sure that you are subscribed. Look at the dog that Amy got. It's a Knickerbocker Poodle. That's well, that, pretty amazing. Well, that, this is the best part. <laughs> for $1.99. It's pretty amazing so thank you guys so much for shopping along with us make sure that you're subscribed if you're not already because there's going to be a lot more fun videos that's going to be coming out of this trip so until next time bye guys red hot mama red hot mama you're the one we need red hot mama some charmer yes indeed you say that i should be in the follies hot tamales you say that i got a pair of eyes just like old spangalies i confess